All right, guys, we're back with another episode. Hey, thank you for joining me again, man. I Mook. appreciate you always, man, I'm, brother. I, I'm excited always. to have you back, man. Always. I man. appreciate it, man. It's yeah, always a took, pleasure. We took a little time off. We did. Okay, guys, uh, you, you already know how we get down. We're going straight to the thumbnail. Red flags that women should watch out for. Um, are there any good men left on the dating market? Mook, that's a heavy one. It really is, bro. Yeah, I think we're going to tackle it pretty heavy tonight, though. Oh, I think so, too. Uh, I don't know if they're ready for it, but we got it for them, though. Well, we ready for them. We got, yeah, okay. we got it for them, though. So, um, what, what what do you feel about that, dude? Let's start off with some red flags that you might have. Uh, uh, what do you got? Man, my first one is guys who just won't go to work, man. Mm. Like, you got you to gotta go to work, man. I mean, typically... Most stand-up women, right? They don't too much care where you work at. Do you have income? Do you have consistent income? Are you working? You have to, bro. I don't care what you got going. And a side hustle would be amazing. Oh, man. If not one or two. A side hustle would be amazing. It'll be amazing. Yeah. But you you at least got to. That's just my first one, though. That's yeah. just my first one, bro. Yeah. So, I mean, I mean, outside of that, how much do he care about the kids? They could be his, yours, mm. ours. That's going to teach you everything you need to know. That's a red flag, bro. If he don't really care about the kids like that, it's all self-game. What, what do you mean the kids? His kids? It could be his kids, your kids, yeah. y'all kids. How he treat the kids. Yeah. That's a red flag. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it pretty much is. Yeah. You don't think so? Well, I, I'm I'm thinking more of uh, ladies that are vetting men mm -hmm. to, to be in a, a relationship. Mm -hmm. So so if if they're already your your yep. kids together, right, right. Then I mean you, it's too late for you. It's, it's not oh for sure, for sure, yeah, for sure, yeah, for yeah, sure. Yeah, you already in the water, baby. For girl. sure, for sure, for sure, yeah, yeah, for yeah. sure, for so sure. I'll I'm, give you I'm, that. Think, I'm, I'm thinking more of uh, his kids. If he if if you know the, the first weeks or so, you know. Uh, he not bringing up his kids or right. nothing, uh, you know, that... Hadn't yeah, said anything. Hadn't said anything, you know. Right, or, right. You know, a picture, nothing. Nothing. So, you know, yeah. yeah his situation or what's going on with him or nothing. But not even just that, Stro, just... Um, I, I, I definitely had uh, no relationship with kids down. That's I, I think that's a, that's a red flag, you know what I'm saying, to me. Is, explain. Uh, it, if, a, if a male doesn't have... A dating age male doesn't have a relationship with his kids. Mm -hmm. uh, first of all, uh, it, it said, "Are there any good men left?" Right. And, I, and I believe that um, most of the good men that are left have kids. Most definitely. Yeah, because uh, eighty-one percent of black men have children. So, so yeah, 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 and that's a fact. So, so more than likely, that's a lie. If a sister looking for a man. Uh, uh, if a woman's looking for a black man, right? He's gonna have kids. A good black man's probably gonna have kids, and he probably take care of his kids. But the guys that don't, don't bring them up first couple weeks. You dating? Get on out of there. Man. Yeah, it's a red flag. Yeah, Run as fast flag. as you can. Yeah, that's a red flag. Run as fast as you yeah. can. He's bro. definitely not gonna take care of you if he's not taking care of them. That's a fact. That's a fact, strong. Yeah. Eighty-one percent is a lot, man. Eighty-one percent is a lot. He gonna have a kid or two. Yeah. Nine times out of ten, and we speaking on good men. Yeah, this is all about what you looking for. Who she looking for? What type of man or male is she looking for? You yeah, know, the other twenty percent, uh, you know, guys on the outskirts. Guys on the outskirts. You know, <laughs> in, in sales and and, and, and the black yep. males that are that aren't dating age. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Mostly in sales. Right. And the youth. Right. Yeah, that the ladies aren't interested in anyway. That's true. Yeah, yeah. True. What else you have, man? Um, I know you got some heat over there. I know you got some heat uh, over there. Yeah, what you got, man? What you got? Rubs hands like Birdman. Um, yeah, man. We we this for the latest tonight. Yeah, it is. Yeah. It's for so, y'all. Um, if, if your first few <clears throat> dates, if he's uh, uh consuming himself with alcohol heavy, mm -hmm. that's probably a red flag. Go ahead and get on out of there. These are some of the minors. Mm -hmm. These minor red flags, but they definitely they can be a super red flag. Because you know this this alcoholic guy could beat you. 
Facts. Yeah, yeah. We don't know what the alcohol gonna make. Facts. Yeah. Um. If he too aggressive, you know, I'm an aggressive guy, but not towards the ladies. Right. You know. So, yeah, you uh, can't be. Yeah, you can't yeah. be. Now, now, now I'm, uh, I'm frank when I'm speaking. Yeah. I ain't talking about that. I'm talking about ag aggressive. You yeah. Know? Uh, it, he control completely trying to control and, and manipulate every situation. I was just about to say every yeah, situation. Every, every, everything, you know what I'm saying? So you got to get up out of there. Yeah, that's probably a red flag. You probably want to get on out but of there. But hold on, but hold on, but Paul, stay there though, because I got a two part question to both of those two that you just said, right? What's up? You ex you said something about the. Um, the alcohol, the alcoholism, or whatever, the first few days. What if she on the same type of time? Um, but both parties definitely need to run for the hills. Uh, <laughs> two alcoholics. Uh, it, this is just not. It, it's not gonna pan out well, guys. It's just not. It's just not. Yeah, uh, statistics uh, say it's yeah, not, it's yeah, not yeah, gonna yeah. pan it, out. Yeah, yeah. Um, Thirty percent of uh, black males uh, don't work full time. Yeah. That's actually yeah, yeah, not yeah, yeah. a crazy stat to yeah. me because you see yeah. it in your everyday oh, life. My bad, guys. Let's repeat it again. Only 37% of black males work full time. So if he's an alcoholic and or he drank heavy, he's probably not a worker. It's something to do, though. Yeah. You know, it's it's something, something, yeah, it's something yeah. to do. No, it is something to do. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Yeah. He can't wait to get home. To yeah. Crack over that bottle, yeah, or whatever. Yeah, no, okay, no, yeah, it, yeah. There's some guys that clock in smelling like alcohol. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? So I don't like, see how they know, do that. Yeah, no, I don't either. But I don't see how they do I, that. But they do it and they work hard yeah, all day. That's a fact. I've seen it done. That's a fact. Yeah, yeah. So, and what was that second? That second one you said? I don't mean to be. Uh, 37 percent of uh black males. Only 37 mm -hmm. percent of black males work full time. Yeah. So, Not, so, so if he drinking. You know what I'm saying? How focused could he be? You know, if I'm saying that the statistics say only 37% work right. full time. Right. That's of working age. So right. These guys already don't want to work. You know. That's our biggest problem, though. Yeah, yeah. And we got to fix ourselves. We have to, bro. Yeah. Like, uh, it, it, I mean, we can't expect a beautiful lady and or an average lady. Right. Fives or less. Right. We can't expect them to even take us serious. If we not even just making the the average, just the the uh, the the male average, the national average for a black male, which right. is forty one thousand. So you you not even bringing in forty one thousand. It's hard to live off forty one thousand in twenty twenty three, going into twenty twenty four. It just is. It's, it's hard to live off that it is. as it is. So it is. if he's making under that, right, right, right. You know, and he's not working, right, and he's drinking. Yeah. I mean, you know, no side gig. And no, no type of extra motion or nothing. No extra just, motion. It ain't gonna work. Run as fast as you can. And he Run as fast as you can. Him. Henry. He called his. Uh, no, he's not a Henry. He's definitely not he's a definitely Henry. Not a Henry. Don't, he's not don't a Henry. Bring Henry up <laughs> with, with this guy right here. Yeah. He's definitely not a Henry. He's definitely not a Henry. Uh, what else you got, Moo? Um, I say this, man. His upkeep. Hmm. His upkeep. Appearance? Appearance is everything. His hygiene. I believe that's a huge one. His weight. Mm. His mental state. It's a lot. You see what I'm saying? It's like, what are you really willing to deal with? Basically. Because it's like, okay, how you look is how I look. How I look is how you look. Same thing we said a few parts ago. Is she willing to give the, the diabetic shots? Every morning, when you, the insulin shots, when you need, is she willing to do that? That's yeah, yeah. that's the difference. Is she high, high blood pressure? You eating fried chicken all the time, and you know hot fronts and all this because you yeah. like that. But yeah. is she willing to say something to you about, hey baby, hey babe, you don't really need this I right think, now. You uh, got, you know. I think women like collarbones. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Paul's necks too. I think women like necks and collarbones. So. You know, yeah, definitely, definitely uh, health and physical condition. Yeah. If, if you're not in physical, you know, shape as a man, and I, I'm not talking about tip top or. Nah, no, we I'm, ain't body shaming either. No. Yeah, we ain't body shaming well, no, either. No, I'm definitely body shaming guys. 
These are okay. guys. Okay. God, we, we don't get a pass for being fat. That's a fact. Okay, I'm trying to lose some fat right now. Or being broke. Okay, we don't get we don't get a pass for being broke or, yep. or, or, or losing weight or, or being fat. You That's know what I'm saying? Fact. Nobody gives us a pass. That's a fact. Okay, you need to get a job and get in shape. You need to make you some money, look like something, and like you said, have some in your mental. Have some in your mental, man. Like man. Yeah, have some in your mental, bro. We only speaking um as far as our situation, not our situation, but our opinion. Henry's. Would you love to elaborate on what a Henry is? Um. Uh. Because you probably uh, could articulate it, it, it better than what I would. Well, it's an acronym. Yeah. And it comes from um. From the great, yeah, uh, late Kevin Simmons. Yep. Uh, I think it's um, high earner, not yet. Uh, it, 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 he's not yet. Uh, he not yet rich. Right. Not rich yet, Henry. Right. High earner. Not rich yet, but he's he's Henry. striving to be. He's striving. Yeah, he, he's a high earner. Yeah, uh, which means uh, just for me, right. for me, I, I'm not Samuel's. Yeah. just for me, uh, ten thousand over the mark, which is the the standard, which is forty one thousand. So the, a guy making fifty one thousand, I know this sound crazy because I know some guys make this probably in a month mm -hmm. or a week. Right, but a guy making fifty one thousand. Is a high earner not yet rich? Because only thirty seven percent of black men um, or even work full time. Full time anyway. Even work full time anyway. So so if so if he's a, a Henry, mm -hmm. but Henrys are not just working full time workers. A uh, Henry has a side hustle mm -hmm. and probably a, a a small business. Yep. Yeah. Henrys. Yeah, they say you got to be uh, have multiple hustles to become a yeah. millionaire. Anyway. So uh, I'm thinking a Henry probably. Let's. I, I, I recant. A uh, Henry gonna start it by seventy five bands. A, a Henry. A Henry. A high earner, okay. not yet rich. Not rich yet. Henry. That's still some good money though. That's strong. A, that's a, no, 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 no. It's not. No, it's not. It's not. Not if, not if we're talking about supporting a family of two, three. Uh, uh, a good woman also comes with uh, probably two kids, two baby daddies. She making something so she, too, though, right? She probably is making yeah. something as well. Right. She's probably making something as well, but it, it, does she want to contribute her money to the... No. Okay. So so what does her money have to do with Henry? Nothing at all. Okay. So Henry has to support this uh, a family and probably a couple kids. That's a fact. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So 75 bands ain't a lot. Henry's trying to make money. 75 is not even Henry's goal. Right. But he's glad to be there. Yeah. But that's just not Henry goal. He working towards it. He's working towards it. He working towards it. He's working towards it. the, the, the $250,000 a year. It's a lot. Yeah. It's a lot. What else you have, man? You, uh, you getting off tonight, man. Pause. Yeah. I'm what, trying to get off. Yeah, what else you got? It's been a while. Yeah, what else you got? Um, I also have... Uh, I think we both have this uh, car job place to live standard these are uh, basic is essentials if he doesn't have car job place to live ma'am get on out the way okay uh, I've been without a car uh, or, or a job or a place to live before and I, I, I wouldn't suffer a woman to have been with me during that time okay don't go with me if I don't have a car job place to live I had to learn it I had to learn it. I can keep 1,000. I had to learn it. Man, you got to have it. I mean, I'm saying. I had to learn it. I'm saying to be worthy of, uh, to be of, worthy. of, of a relationship and or a partnership. Yeah. Trying to be with somebody. Yeah. You know, and they, and we, and they thinking as far as future with you. True. I mean, my God. Stability. Uh, my last couple, uh, probably shouldn't be my last couple, man. You know, probably should have been my first, which is a vision. Uh, where are you? What do you see yourself in the next three to five years? Um, uh, men are supposed to have vision, and women are supposed to be submissive. She can't submit. Ladies, do not submit if there's nothing to follow. Where are you leading us to? Where are you leading us to? I think you said that before. I did. Where are you leading us to? I asked uh, what to do you see yourself in, 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 in the next three to five years? Do you got some vision for us? For me? What do you see me? I'm, I'm speaking as a woman. Get off, get off, because I, I got some. You did, I get off, because oh, I got man, something to add hard. to that. Get off, though. Go you, ahead, go yeah, ahead. I'm just saying, like, bro, that taught me a valuable lesson. That, that right there, what you just said, which I said a couple of pods ago, 
Like I really wanted this woman Like bad So I thought right And then once I laid out All the stuff that I felt like I could do for her Do for us And she was like What is your three to five year plan And at the time I didn't have one And she was like How can I take me and my kids And follow you And you're not leading us to nowhere Now to me Jesus Christ it, it, This woman that you talking about With zero dollars Is a high value woman yep. Because the way she uh, Her mind is set up uh, with, Hey Shout out Shout out, baby girl. You know who you is. Um, uh, uh, another red flag mm. for for ladies to watch out for guys. In my opinion, does he come from a two parent household? W was a father figure around? And when I say father figure, that that can be a um, a. Uh, uh, he spends summers with his grandfather or, or he spends a lot of time with his uncle It doesn't have to be his biological father Big brother is, is it, Yeah, any of that is, is, is he in a two-parent household? It's going to tell you a lot, ladies I'm not going to even go into that Because that, it can get really controversial No pun? That's major Go ahead No pun No, that's major No, thanks Because so. that, that make a big difference, bro Like how he was raised as a two-parent household was it? Because his values and more is going to be different mm. if it's a two-parent household, which is we feel like it's common sense. Yeah. It, yeah. We feel like it's common sense, so we ain't even really even got to get into that. But well, that's, well if, he was, if he was raised by a single mother, I wouldn't put it past that, that, that male to uh, have some traits of that, that, that mother. Did, did, did she, is she argumentative when she... When Naturally Frustrated oh, Naturally okay. Where well, he might be that way as well I mean I don't think If My dad told me If you can win an argument With a woman You're not a man Yup <laughs> So don't I mean what Shout it, out to Cooney love Shout out to Cooney What he was really saying Is don't waste uh, your breath man yep. It's okay You know what I'm saying Keep You're going. gonna lose Yeah 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 you're gonna lose Well you should I mean I'm, You don't got to lose You can be No You, you, you can make sure that, that, that They catch your point And you can No for sure uh, But yeah, yeah, yeah. Let them get off. Let them get. Let off. her get off. Bro. Let her get off. She'll feel better. Let her get off. Um, last but not least, yep. um, does he have a spiritual life? Does he believe in God? I didn't want to go there, but I have to go there because that's a major red flag. Um, uh, most guys, twenty twenty three, going into twenty twenty four. Most guys will tell you if they don't believe in God. I mean, they bold with it now. Off the rip. Off the rip. They bold with it. So, ladies, don't rip. be afraid to ask, do you believe in God? And when you say God, be specific about your God, lady. Yep. Whoever, whoever your God, your high power is. Okay? That's a fact. Yeah, yeah. Do we have a spiritual life? But what if she don't, though? What do you mean? If she don't have a spiritual life, do it really matter? But if that's got a red one? flag for guys. I would go both ways. If she doesn't have a spiritual life, yeah. and and he doesn't have a spiritual life, then they they mate. They, yeah, that's true. That's great. Like, that's true. If you don't have a spiritual life and you don't want him, that's to have true. One, that's true. You know, it's still a valid. Oh, he just don't have saying. one. It is. It hey, is. Everybody get a spiritual life. Okay. That's a fact. We're not just. This is not a coincidence. Okay. That's a fact. We're made out of everything in the universe. Right. That's here. a fact. In one person. Yeah. That's a fact. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's a fact. Yeah, we got right. nine holes. You right. Come on, man. You right. Stop playing. You right. Yeah. Can I say something though? Get off. Um, we already kind of touched on the pause, but fellas, go get a job, man. Please, bro. This this you at do dirty house all day playing Madden, getting it up all day. You up under your partner all day. Come on, bro. You know, strong. I always got a gripe each episode. Each I have to at least one time. Go get a job, bro. Mook. Please. Some type of motion. Mook just got off, and I just got to go ahead and back him yeah. uh, with the facts. Of black men ages 16 to 64, 41% of them had no earnings. Hold up. Repeat that. Please, one more time. Repeat that. 16 to what? Of black men ages 16 to 64 years old. Mm-hmm. 41% of them had no earnings, zero. So uh, so I, I concur with Mook. Go get you some money, guys. Get you some money. Please go okay. get you something, bro. Yeah. What was the quote you said? Because it's, it's, it's cliche, but it's true. But you will never lose women chasing money, mm, but you will lose money chasing women. Oh, man. Oh, man, that was hard. That's a beautiful quote. It's true though. It's a beautiful quote. It's true though. Yeah, that's a beautiful quote. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Um, so my my final answer to uh, are there any good men left on the dating market? 
because we gave our red flags, is, um, yeah, but he's probably going to come with a child or two. Uh, he's probably going to be uh, uh, mid to late 30s right. uh, and or early 40s. He's, uh, y- you're going to be able to tell because he's going to have some things together and he's just going to be making some type of breakthrough. Okay, and and he doesn't need you to make uh make make his life hard. Okay, he needs you to make something else hard, ladies. Okay, so so try to find a way to to you know don't bother him too much because you're gonna know when you see a Henry. That's a fact. You're gonna know when you run into That's a, a Henry, fact. And, and you're gonna know when you run into a, a Tyrone. A you know what we called him earlier. <laughs> oh. Pookie. Pookie. You it know, Pookie, Pookie, yeah. Pookie, when Pookie walked through the door, I mean, you know Pookie he ain't got bad, no job. Pookie, Pookie don't got no job. He living off of you. Pook, hey, Pookie is a wonderful lover. Pushing your car when you I'm at talking work. About Pookie, Pookie, Pookie good looking. Pookie tall. Pookie everything they like. That's a fact. He know how to touch that button. That's a fact. Yeah, he, th- he touched that button real That's good, a fact. Man. That's a fact. Pook, I ain't got no bag now. That's a fact. Nah, he ain't got no bag. Nah, Pook, I ain't got, he ain't no, got bag. no bag. I want to add this too to, to men, man, to us men. Accept that women kids like she accept yours. Mm. Can you do that? Accept her kids like she accept yours. Whether they bad or not, that's up to you to, to agree to if that's what you want to deal with or not. But you know going in, accept that kids the same way, man. That's all I'm saying. Match the energy. That's all. I love that. That's all. That's all we got for you. Hey, man. That's all you got anything? Else? Yeah, bro. You got it off, bro. I had to, hey, it was ice on you. Hey, man, you, you I kept, passed the ball and got to the corner. Damn, it, it, Sometimes you got to do that. Yeah, you kept throwing it up. Sometimes you got to do hey, that. That's major, guys. Thanks for joining us. Always. Yeah, subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> subscribe. That's how the magic is made, son. You gotta play pink.